Hi, this is Dan. Let's talk about the Constitution. The U.S. Constitution is the law that governs America. The Constitution is like a small book. You know how books have chapters? Well, the Constitution doesn't have chapters. It has a preamble, which we read last time, remember that? It also has seven articles and 27 amendments. Can you remember those numbers? It has seven articles and 27 amendments. I'll test you in a minute to see if you remember. Now, just like your parents have rules for you to follow, America has a constitution under which rules are made that we must follow. Who makes these rules? Well, the constitution tells us. Here's what it says. All legislative powers herein granted shall be vested in a Congress of the United States, which shall consist of a Senate and House of Representatives. Wow, those are some big words in there, right? Did you hear that? Legislative powers. <laughs> Sounds like a superhero, right? Not a cow, I said superhero. Don't worry, we shouldn't be afraid of those words. The term means that Congress can make rules for the country just like your parents make rules for you. So the answer to our question, who makes the rules, is Congress makes the rules. Since these two groups make the rules for America, the people elected to those offices need to be wise. Therefore, the Constitution says they need to be old enough to serve in office. They can't be a little kid. A person can't become a senator until he or she is at least 30 years old. And a person can't become a representative until he or she is at least 25 years old. That means they have to be as wise and smart as your mom and dad are before they can be elected. Just think, maybe one day you'll be as smart as your mom or dad. And when that happens, do you think you'll be a senator or representative when you're that smart? Hey, the country needs you, so get real smart. So let's see what we've learned in this lesson. And to do that, let's play a little game show. First question. You ready? Who makes the rules for America? That's right. Congress. Good job. I knew you'd get it. Second question. What are the two groups that make up the Congress called? Got it again. That's right. The Senate and House of Representatives. Man, you're really smart. Okay, now I'm going to give you tough questions since you're so smart. You ready? How many articles does the Constitution have? I'll give you time to think about it. <laughs> it's seven. It's seven. It's seven. I'll say it out loud. It's seven. Did you say seven? That is awesome. Good. You got it right. Man, you're really smart. Okay, last question. You ready? How many amendments does the Constitution have? Think about it. It's 27. 27. I'll say it out loud. 27. 27, you got it. That's awesome. You're really good. How did you get so smart? I think you're going to be the next senator or representative from your state. I can't wait. The Constitution is a fun document, isn't it? Read it, know it, share it. This is Dan. That's all I have time for. I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye. Oh, and don't forget to be good. Together.